Peace to the leaders, achievers, hip hop believers, and future seers. You already know, man. It's your boy, the overrides, the man who definitely does control the hype. SA Hip Hop on the Grind is in the street trying to figure out what the word is. So, the word on the internet streets is that um, there are lists that have been dropped and the people are not agreeing. So, now we are in the streets of um, Josie and we are just, just trying to figure out what people are thinking towards both lists. The first list that dropped was um, the top 30 hip hop groups of all time, and the second list that dropped was um, the top 50 artists of all time. One was done by TL, which is Casper's manager, and the other one was done by the legendary Rashid K. So follow me in the streets and let's see what the people got to say. Oh, I was just trying to get the word on the streets and uh, we're chilling with the homie by the name of Schoolboy, the Prince of Maboneng. Hey King, how you doing bro? We are sad, my nigga, what's popping? Ah, dog, you know what's popping, bro. Those lists right there, bro. First and foremost, what's your take on it? And um, yeah, and then I'll ask you furthermore. Um, so first of all, I feel like both lists are, are garbage. Maybe they're totally, maybe the one with the groups is probably like more convincing. I, I can lean over to it, but like, I feel like it was based on preference on who knows who and stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah. But I'm, I'm not, I'm not impressed, man. I'm not convinced as well. Okay. So who's supposed to be on those lists, Machi? My nigga, um, cats like Aries, Nasty, um, Ricky's Java, MC, those are the niggas who should be at the top. You can't put in, okay, yeah, the legends. You can't put in Casper right now, dog, on the top of the list. He hasn't done anything for hip hop for the past two years. So I refuse to give him those flowers, bro. Like, for real. Damn, bro, for real? Dog, there's Abo Makera, dog, that should be at the top right now. That's my point. Like, there's hot niggas, about 25K, they've been doing moves that we actually can see in the game, you know? They're shaking the game literally not because they used to, not because we they've earned their respect because they once were, you know. They currently are. Oh, so you all about the new wave. Fuck all the old shit. Yeah, Doc, what's the current situation right now in the hip-hop space? What's going on right now? You yeah, know what I mean? Yeah. So yeah, it's not impressing me. Um really hurt. I saw it online, I was like, nah, no way. <laughs> First of all, I'm just gonna say. Double HP shouldn't be number one. No disrespect. Yeah. But double HP shouldn't be number one. Pro kids shouldn't be number one. They had their time. They did what they needed to do. They put on the youngins. It's time for the youngins to take over. Nasty she should have been number one. And maybe, you know, some of the niggas that followed like Blackie, my Clara Doughboy, we can't forget what the youngins are doing. These are the next, these are the next double HPs of the game. You feel me? And I'm probably one of the next double HPs of the game. My name is Jesse Loan, so yeah. That's what I say about the list. Some of these rappers shouldn't even be here. Okay, okay. that list is pretty cool. It's showing light to South African hip hop and South African hip hop groups. Now, yeah. In terms of criteria, I just listen to music, man. So each group, I'm looking at the groups right now that are yeah. on the top 10. Each group has its own element that it brought to South African hip hop. Yeah. You cannot take Witness the Funk. Yeah. And compare with Nesta Funk with 9 and 5. Hey. They're not in the same era. Hey. But yeah. although they were a group yeah. in South African hip hop, which means they made an impact in yes, South African hip hop. So I mean, I'm pretty chill with this group. Yeah, yeah, no, it's fine. I don't care who's number one, I don't care who's number last. Yeah. But it's calm, it's calm. It's showing lights to South African hip hop. Never. A <laughs> word? What? 985 can't be with. 985 can be on 21. If what? If Dream Team is on 13. Can never. Damn. And, yeah. and, and then you can have their wrecking crew. Yeah. And put ben, and put benchmark on 28. Okay, so where's the wrecking crew and where's benchmark? Wrecking crew's on 11. Yeah. Benchmark is on 28. But then I think shit is wrong, bruh. Yeah, but don't you think it's a matter of um, impact? Because now, what did Benchmark actually do in the game? We know them. So, like, who gets to decide this shit, bruh? Because now it seems like any random person who has some kind of accolade can come through and say what's what. That's the thing about the industry, bro. It's gatekeepers. Gatekeepers are the ones that dictate this shit, bro. Yeah. We can't say anything and we can't control anything, but the gatekeepers can. It's the same. It's the same as the same situation that Kevin Hart was speaking about. These, they, yeah. they, 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 Cat Williams? Cat Williams, yeah. yeah. He was talking about Kevin Hart gatekeeping, yeah. you know, a yeah. lot of comedians. So it's always the gatekeepers that get to decide this, not everyone else. 
Damn, bro. So Casper's manager is a gatekeeper, in your opinion? Definitely, bro. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. It's the same as Blackie. Yeah. Blackie's being gatekeeped by that manager chick. Yeah. Because there's yeah. that scandal that came out that yeah. he doesn't own half of the things that he owns. Feel me? So there's gatekeepers in the industry. That's what we all have, gotta have to know. There's yeah. gatekeepers in the industry. You just gotta have to be smart, play your part, and do it in a smart way. Especially if you're in the music industry, so you don't end up in this type of place. Uh, bro, like uh, I feel like the fans gotta decide. How about you let the fans vote for who who they think is the best? Because the fans are the consumers of the music. The pioneers actually gonna like vouch for their friends, their peers, and people who have rubbed shoulders with them. But in in reality, we know whose hearts. You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 I, it's yeah. like I'm gonna vote for you because I have you. Ah, he's my nigga. We yeah, outside, so yeah, yeah. let me put him on the top. Yeah. You feel me? Um, yeah. So, what's your take on like rev- uh, groups like Revivolution and um, SOS not being there? Revival is not on the damn. I maybe that was his opinion. You get me? Yeah, yeah. If I made a group, I'd have made a different one, not as the, not as the, not the same as his, but I would have made a different one, depending on also. When I started listening to South African hip hop, you yeah, hear me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, how long I've been exposed to South African hip hop yeah. and when it caught me, you get me? Yeah. So I see there's Dream Team, there's Major Skis, you get me? Those are the people that are, are in my age group, so to say. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a lockdown recovery, my outie. Yeah, dog. Yeah, okay, and, so now in, ter- in terms and of. And then 985, nine, 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 yeah. it can never be there if we have. Um, Yeah, to me the volume, to me the volume can't be there because of they were never, never South African. They were hip hop before South Africans caught on hip hop, right? So then as soon as we caught on hip hop, to me the volume, it was a group from wherever. Yeah. We don't know even one Alpha. Yeah. I can yeah. even put WTF before to, to me, me the volume. volume. Yes, Damn, because bro. I know that person, right? Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So I'm, I'm, I'm saying from. 2000 to yeah, yeah, let yeah, me say 2005 yeah. to yeah if the list is from there because of if i'm still c p o c that means it yeah, comes it from, the from the 90s from the 80s 80s and yeah, shit so the list is way back but to me the volume can't be there Platforms, man. we are sa hip-hop on the grizzly grind man yeah. my homie cooley right here bro talking that here. smack check the master class hip-hop we are back this year next week we're shooting it means your next friday won't be the same Exactly, man. Check, Check out the masterclass, yeah. and that's exactly what's going to be going on, man. Over easy. Over easy. <laughs>